So we have to add one over two plus one over three. We're gonna perform the addition of these fractions in this video. So in order to do this, we need to make sure that we have the same denominator. The denominator is the number that's on the bottom. So here there's a two and here's a three. So you want what's called a common denominator. In this case, that number is gonna be six. And one thing that you can always do is just multiply these two numbers. Two times three is six. So six is your goal. So in order to get a six here, uh, we have a two, we're missing a uh, three. So what you do is you multiply by one in a clever way. You multiply by three over three. Okay, and there's other ways of doing this problem. There's other tricks you can do and stuff. I just wanted to show you this way because this is a powerful way that will scale to harder problems. And then here we have a three and we're missing a two. So we multiply by two over two. So the three times one is three, and three times two is six. And then we have our plus. Two times one is two, two times three is six. You see how I did that? You basically just multiply straight across up top and on the bottom. And now we have the same denominator, right? The number on the bottom is called the denominator. The number up top is called the numerator. So we can add the fractions and you just basically add the numerators. Three plus two is five. So we get five over six, and the answer to this problem is five over six. So straight up fractions problems, uh, worth doing, worth practicing. Um, that's awesome. Take care.